Hi everyone. Today I'm going to share how I created this cream ready plant tree. So here I created with that 11,000 polygon. So let's start. Select the tree, add the trunk. From spine, increase the length to 45 feet. Go to trunk, go to geometry, add branch, go to generation, change the mode to absolute to absolute state, then increase the steps i'll create it uh okay nine for the moment after that i can reduce it and per step i'll keep five for the moment if it's too much because i i'll create it, uh, this one under ten thousand polygon or eleven thousand so now we already have twenty seven thousand polygon so go to branch go to segment reduce the poly count from that uh, length and we can reduce from the radius also here select the branch go to generation um, go to spine first then click here and double click somewhere here make a knot and keep on the this top position up because we don't need to keep everything up we need this one to be little bit down this part so we can put little bit down this part and to give accurate shape we can make different different note and we can give different different shape like nice round shape so here you can see some are big, some are small. Those things we will uh, fix later. So now this top part, uh, it's uh, too long for me. That uh, length is too much. So what I have to do is go, I'll go to generation and select this uh, size scaler also from that. If you double click here, you can create a knot and reduce the length only from the top. From spine also you can do the same go to spine length you can because I, I reduce the length from here because that leaves also will be little bit smaller than here select uh, this one to a step now go to spine and reduce the length little bit to give a nice round shape for the moment okay so now uh, oh this one is too long reduce a little bit So now our polygon is 9600 this is also too much but we'll fix it later and now select the branch go to branch again go to spine and start angle to up now we can increase it increase the number go to spine read. take the starting angle. try to make it round just the way i have shown select one and select the tab and then you can make it you can give nice round shape for all over the tree 
So forget about the polygon for the moment. I'll fix them. Now go to uh, branch, add some twin. Okay. So now you can see this kind of this one is uh, coming out. So we can put them in and give some round shape for all over the tree. Or else we can do at the end also. Like however you like to. So now I like to add the texture. Select this trunk. Um, go to material. Input material. So I will import that dark material. So here I have imported only the base color map. So if I want, I can add that normal and glossiness too. Increase the contrast. Now you can see the detail. So here we have only like 199,000 polygon, but uh, we have to make it under 10K. So we'll reduce it. So now go to twin and then go to leaf, add leaf. Go to skin, increase the size, go to orientation, and then from here, right amount, out amount. Okay, keep like this for the moment. And now you can see clearly which one you have to put in. So if you just select this one, press tab, select this one, press tab, and you can put them in like this. And give some nice round shape. So we are, it will take time, so I'm just showing quickly how to do that from one side. You can do from all over like this kind of part you have to keep in just you can keep like that okay so our leaves is like 3200 and yeah 82 and that is fine so now select the leaf add the leaves material so i'll add the leaf material So I have created two uh, textures. One is uh, for green, another is orange. So here, select this one and take these two sides so here you can see these kind of things are out so we need to keep them in again select that branch and then keep them in by pressing tab now select the leaves and go to generation or skin sorry and increase the size a little bit we need to keep this up so from here go to generation change the position a little bit up now select the leaf go to cut out mesh go to edit and add some more meshes a polygon okay for the moment i'll keep only one uh, vertices in the middle then when you we um fold this leaf then now you can see it's uh, flat but after adding that one polygon here 
uh, you can see the difference now you can fold it this way and like as much as polygon you can um, add you have that much of um, freedom to adjust according to your reference so like that and now I will hide this twin because I don't need it because it will not be visible when you look in it will not be visible because the way I created the texture like it has already the stamp and some groups so with one texture you can cover um, like a lot of leaves so this kind of thing we need to just press tab we can put in these leaves and arrange as you want basically spend some time on it and uh, keep a ref reference image real reference image and adjust according to that so here now we have 127,000 so this branch also we can hide it this one has 8000 polygon uh, so what you have to do is give to segment uh, go to relative amount and reduce this to no, 5000 is too much 3000 okay now the trunk also has uh, 1000 so trunk also you can reduce to something like uh, okay 220 for the moment the main trick is as nicely you can arrange the leaves when you need that you, you just need to hide it when you need to arrange the leaf just unhide the twin or any branch and press tab and make it because it's very challenging to keep uh, low poly and making a uh, nice detail and realistic one uh, so you have to uh, follow this method now you can see we have 100 so now we have 10,000 polygon and now uh, nicely we can just rearrange the leaves like here i made uh, all of them so here i just reduced the leaf size also as you can see here go to generation our skin you can reduce the size also So that's how I created this one. I uh, hope this is helpful. Only keep some time and arrange them. So it looks uh, still 3500 polygon if you want we can reduce more from and you can see this is very straight so i feel to give some uh add some late amount on it but we need to increase some polygon from length i'm increasing a little bit and from radius i'm reducing it And I'm increasing from this. Okay. Now unhide the leaves. Hide twins. Keep the 
Mm. Right. Now select those branches, press tab, select one, press tab, now keep them in. Press tab and you can give us a nice shape also select them press tab leaves and even though individual leaves when you select to go to orientation you can give uh, Like you, you can give the orientation the way it's supposed to be. So what are the floating leaves are here? Groups. You can just uh, simply select them. Rotate them or else can do with hand uh, or else you can do it here so it might take time so I'm just quickly showing uh, how to make it so ultimately you can just make like this with a thin 11,000 polygon. Thanks for watching.